channel, Miss Crochet and Coffee here, and I'm just warming my piggies by the imaginary fire. It's actually a heater, but um, I felt bad because I couldn't do my uh, ceiling video, so now that it's dried up outside a little bit and it finally stopped snowing, I figured I'd go ahead and do that, and you can look at my carpet today because I, I vacuumed. Yay. All right. So, I also thought I'd introduce you to uh, Mr. Killian Jones. That's my Siberian Husky. Killian, say hi. You're a dog. You can't say hi. And then we have Miss Daisy, the German Shepherd. All right. So, and there's Olaf and Maggie Socks. So, for your ceiling of your diamond paintings, what I like to do is um, first pick up these socks because why are they on the floor? We're gonna be moving around a lot, so if you get seasick, like close your eyes or something. First, I find a box, because you don't wanna just seal on the concrete outside. I don't own this place, so I'm not trying to like get it all damaged. So you, you find a box. Oh, and that's Link from Zelda. But you find a box. Look, a box. Now I'm gonna pause and find a diamond painting, because as you already know, I have a bunch of them. So we're gonna seal one of them. So I got a box, now I need a diamond painting. Let me see if I can find a diamond painting. Hey look, I found a diamond painting. All right, now you need your sealer. Hey look, sealer. Okay, so now that I have sealer, a box, and my diamond painting, first you gotta pick out which sealer you wanna use. Now, a lot of people have used the Mod Podge, yet no, don't do that. Don't, we're just, get out of here. We're not gonna use that. We're gonna use this one. This one works, no. No, that does not work. Do not put that on your work. I'm telling you right now, if you put that on your work, it will dull the shine like nobody's business. Like you'll be so mad. And believe me, I know because I did it and I'm so mad. Get, get out of here. No. So we're going to use this one. This one will not dull your shine. So now what we got to do is we got to make that not a box anymore because you kind of kind of lay it flat. So now that you have your box, get it flat hey look it's flat all right now you want to go outside because you don't want to do this in the house i learned it the hard way don't do it in the house take it outside okay now we're outside and we have our box and we have our diamond painting now you want to make sure there's nothing on your diamond painting like green fuzz you want to make sure there's nothing on it and that it's laying flat so we're going to lay it flat and I don't know how many coats of this we're going to put on here, but I'm probably going to do three. So, like, every 15 minutes I'll come out and we'll do another one. But this is the first one. Make sure your piggies are away from the stuff. So, just evenly spray it on there. We're going to spray the crap out of it. I don't want any of these diamonds to come off. All right. That should be good for right now. We're going to let that sit out here for about mm, 15 minutes and then we'll come back. And apparently while we're waiting for our diamond painting to dry, Mr. Killian Jones wants to play. High five? No, don't lick my hand. High five. Thank you. Mr. Killian Jones says hi. This is my doggy. We're, this is my husband's dog. High five? No, there's no food. Good boy. Now that it's been 15 minutes, we're going to spray it again. Make sure you do it evenly all throughout the painting so that you don't have spots missing. Heavy coat. Heavy coat because it's cold outside, y'all. It was snowing here earlier and then it started raining. Not the heavy coat's on there. This is the outside balcony area as to where I live. It looks cold, don't it? It is freezing. But I got my monster slippers on, so I'm good. So we're gonna let that sit there for another mm, 15 minutes. Okay, so it's been about 15 minutes, and I'm coming to check on it, and it it's not quite dry yet. It's still a little tacky, so we're just gonna let that sit out here a little bit. But, as you can see, it stiffened it, which is awesome. You can't really see shine on it, because it's well, it's gray outside, people. It was raining. So we're going to let that lay back down and dry for a little bit longer. You going to hang in there? 
you can hang in there. All right. And now that it's been another 15, maybe hour, two hours that it's been sitting out here, it's nice and dry. So we're going to take it in the house and check the sparkle. All right. So we brought it back in the house. Now, let's check to see if it's still shiny. Now, you're going to see my shadow. Don't worry about that. So we have the lamp on just because I want to show to see if it sparkles. And as you can see, it's still sparkly. Again, it's going to be shadowy. I'm sorry. But this is a hard angle. So as you can see, it still shines. It's still sparkly. I might have left it outside a little bit longer than uh, 15 minutes. I had to cook dinner, people. Let's see. Yeah, I'd still say it's shiny and sparkly. I mean, you can see it on the tree there and on the mountains. It's kind of harder to see it. Well, you can see it a little bit there. And again, what I used was this. Because I saw kicking cancer's butt with diamond painting using it. So get that at your local Walmart. If they don't have it in the store in the crafting section, look at walmart.com. And they'll definitely have it there. So that's what I used. It doesn't seem to still the sparkle. It's still sparkly. So yeah. That's how I seal my diamond paintings. Now, I have two down. Or three down. Um, Like eight more to go. But you guys won't see that. That's boring. You guys will just catch me in my next video. I will probably be putting up my next video, of course, on Monday, because normally on Saturdays I don't post, but I figured this was a special occasion because I really wanted to seal this one for my husband because it's his birthday present, and his birthday is on Monday. So, like, I don't know the angles to get this thing to sparkle. So, yeah, but you see it. It didn't harm it in any way. It's still, you know, a diamond painting. It didn't dull it. Now... See, if I go from the side here, you can see it sparkling on the tree there. All right, so right next to it on the wall here is my Soul Keeper. Where it still sparkles, the shine has been dulled tremendously. So, like, it's kind of upsetting. But this one seems to have kept it, there we go, seems to have kept it sparkle. So I would prefer the Patricia's over the Mod Podge. So, again, go get it at your local Walmart. I'll actually link it down below. Well, that's it for me, folks. I gotta go make dinner now and be a mommy. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you aren't already. Hi, and welcome to all of you who are. I appreciate each and every one of you. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!